welcome back guys and i just passed 500 subscribers i think today or maybe yesterday i'm not quite sure but i want to thank you guys all for the support and in turn i wanted to start doing separate videos where i give you advice and opinions on certain things throughout this game so the first thing that i want to talk about in this video is the women's soul reaper association the reason i want to talk about that first is because that's something i would often neglect when i was a new player and it's so important for two reasons first when you max out a character you have the chance of getting four objects as you can see here each character those uh, things differ but also when you max out a character you immediately get 500 gems so if you're trying to farm keys for the boss characters this is a great way to get quite a lot of gems mid to late game so you won't be getting this any of this early game but mid to late game especially when you're trying to clutch those gems this is a great way to get gems and as i already mentioned the second thing is that when you feed the character you now have a chance of getting four of those things that you can see there so the reason i love nimu so much is because she gives you spirit potions now for me that is essential for when i'm trying to farm a lot of a certain character when i'm trying to farm fragments in general not only that but she also gives you purple hogyokus which is which i'm very in demand for the same with isane so nothing major nothing too long in this video i just want to make sure you guys are ma trying to max out all of your characters make sure you feed them three times a day that's the max times you can feed them so you can max the bar out grab 500 gems and you can also get much better rewards some of these characters also give a uh, reishi actually let me see if i can find one i think it's yeah so you can also get back the amount you spend on actually feeding the character which is also a big plus so thanks for watching guys let me know what you want to see next or what you want advice on next and i will try to do a video about that one more thing i want to mention in this video is some people ask me where to get certain characters now if you ever want to know where to get a character simply click on that character click on the fragment piece and it will tell you the locations of where that character can be obtained from so jishiro that's the shop where we can get jishiro from I did get a question about Hitsugaya, so I'm going to show you where to get Hitsugaya. It's from the Soul Trial shop, and that's right there. I personally don't think Hitsugaya is amazing after level 6 or rank 6, depending on what you want to call it, because he doesn't get any more visual changes, and that kind of puts me off. That's the reason mine is pretty much stuck at level 6, and I don't intend on taking him any further at the moment. So with that said, thanks for watching guys, feel free to like, comment, share and subscribe, I'm out.